you know Scotty? No, I do not. So the whole barbecue you see over here on the on the left, which you already filmed, it's fitting into that little backpack. Carries completely six and a half pounds, packed completely flat, fits under any car seat, anywhere you want to have it. It's super simple to set up. If you let me show it like in a minute or in sure. rest, maybe 55 seconds. So the nine pieces you need are all here. There's a functionality that says we have two triangles on the top corner, so you know which is the first set to slide into. You take the remaining long piece, and in no time, with our grease pan, you can have already a regular fire pit. So you lock it here. If you want to use it with charcoal and wood the traditional way, very free to do so. The main renovation piece though is this one. It's a portable gas burner pipe. Mm. It's actually the yeah. first of its kind in the world that's certified and patented. It's as simple as it is genius. Just let it slide in. Nothing can happen. Again, as I said, fully certified. You take the heat distribution, and with the last piece, you simply collect this, slide it slightly upwards, and just let it slide back in. And in no time, with our three and a half millimeter stainless steel hand polished, great. Oh. You have set up your full barbecue from flat packed in a bag you set up in no time. It connects to all the portable gas things that you see, either the travel bottle, you can use a connector to get to the regular propane bottles, not a problem. So the choice of fuel, isobutane, propane, gas, wood, uh, gas, charcoal, uh, wood charcoal, it's up to you. The same actually principle applies to our cap, the lid, same functionality, gets into the same box if you want to, so you only have to carry one bag. And then the cap, Sorry, my bad. It's five individual stainless steel pieces. It has a handle here. Oh, that's cool. Has some wow, look at that. And the handle also simultaneously works as your grill charm. Two little bottle openers because we like to be everyone. Yeah. Like be every once in a while. Yeah. If that is too much air or you don't need the surface, but you just want to have some minor circulation, you slide it to the other side and it gives you like a little ventilation piece. Very nice. So the whole set right here, as you can see, it fits into one bag. Together, like eight and a half pounds, the barbecue alone is six pounds, the cap on top another two and a half pounds. If you're sick and tired of barbecuing, I just show you what the cap really does because it unlocks the barbecue into more or less a full outdoor kitchen. What we also have is like a little pizza stone, for example. Oh, so great. Slide in the pizza stone here. Look at that. And instead of taking the full cap, you just take out the last piece of the cap. And now with a three-piece setup, you have a perfectly workable pizza. Oh, look at that. You remember the handle I just showed you before? Yeah. Detach it, again, completely flat pack as well. Take our flip, which we both can use for turning patties around on the regular grill, but also works perfectly as a little pizza handle. Uh -huh. so now you're done with the pizza, and you say like, oh, I'm good, I want to cook up some hot water and just want to boil some water whatsoever not a problem let's go back to the basic setup and use one of our stainless steel boxes the same material for all the highest quality you'll find in the market they have a little inlay a rubber and orange so if you get anything pre-cooked marinated bring it to the campsite once you arrive over there with the lid perfectly locked you take it off take the rubber band out and you're ready to cook your meal. Even if you want to cook up some spaghetti with some sauce over here on the side, not a problem, you can do that as well. So instead of only having a barbecue, you actually have an oven. You can use the top, which you can see here, as a flat secondary heat surface. That's on purpose, mm. easily. Mm. I'm gonna keep some stuff hot, just put a pan inside and you have a secondary heat pan. Wow. So it's a barbecue, it's an oven, you can use it as a regular stove. If you're sick and tired of that, use a couple of our chicken skewers or vegetable skewers. They have the little tiny, tiny angles here and they fit perfectly. So just stick them in, even after a long night, turn them around 180 degrees and you just burn the other side. Perfectly fine. Wow. It's like a Swiss, it's like a Swiss army knife of That's barbecues. Easy. We just want you to just take one yeah. item out, one right. equipment. We don't want you to carry a pizza oven, a stove, a barbecue, so everything we develop will always fit into that little framework, the box, it's what you need. It's fully portable, it's fully flexible in regards to the fuel types you use, and also whatever you want to cook with it, perfectly fine. You're free to do whatever you like. Okay. And where is this manufactured? This is manufactured, designed and, and produced in Germany. We manufacture in Hungary. Ah. Tip it over to the US, right? Fantastic, and the price point? 
So the barbecue, as you can see right here, is usually 199, and the cab is another 99, and the accessories around are like between 25 and 40 dollars. Okay, okay. Do you have a card? Absolutely. Even on the backside, also forever sees that there's this code on there, starting new trendy because we went out of all the product here. We had 50 barbecues earlier yesterday morning completely sold out. Use Scotty New Trendy until the end of November and you get 20% off for all the people who see this. Fantastic, thank you. You're very welcome. You sold out, congratulations. Yeah, we didn't, we had a huge car and a little trailer. Yeah. Since our warehouse is somewhere in Colorado, it's tough for us yeah. to like, bring yeah. stuff here. But we're super happy. It's like the first three months in the United States as a new brand from Germany and appreciate your feedback. Welcome. Appreciate it, thank, thank you so you. much, sir. Okay, okay. fantastic, bye now, bye. see you.